see look a lot more lit on the S9. What about you? Which phone do you guys prefer? Let us know in the comment section below. Ooh. Hey guys, Hi. welcome to the unofficial review of the Samsung Galaxy S9 camera. What? We have taken this beast and put it against the Samsung Galaxy S7, the Ooh. iPhone 10, the Ooh. iPhone 8, Ooh. all that malarkey. Ooh. And yes. we've been testing out this beast in low light, in good light, in sexy light, in unsexy light, <laughs> <laughs> front facing camera, back camera. We have literally scoured the earth for all of those top selling phones out there. And we are so excited to share with you guys which phone is gonna win the camera test. My friends, we are live here at the beach and we're taking you on a front facing camera test. I've got both phones in my hands, the iX and the Samsung Galaxy S9. The cool thing about this today is that is pretty damn windy. It's so, pretty windy. yeah, this is also a microphone test. Interestingly enough, there's actually a cyclone coming. What? Cyclone Linda. But it's the, it's the Gold Coast Commonwealth Games coming up. Good luck to all you athletes that might be competing. Alrighty, to me it sounds like the S9 cancels noise slightly better. And it seems to be handling the exposure of the sky, the sea, the beach better here too. This is the Kmart experience. We are gonna buy some stuff from here. Let's go. I am cool because I am in the sports section. I'm ready to get spotty. You wanna get spotty with me? Let's go get some spottiness. I've got my equipment, got my active wear, and now it's time to get training. I'm gonna go and hang out with you instead because you're too cool. Yay! Slow mo time! We are here live doing the iPhone X versus Samsung Galaxy S9 front facing camera and cameras test. Now which camera do you prefer? Let us know. I reckon I like the one on this side. I like this one better. Ooh, hello, hello, hello. Also, we have been filming downstairs, filming? Downstairs in the car park where it's a lo little bit bad light.
As you can see, the iPhone X is raining grains. It's grainy AF. Alright, this is the iPhone X versus Samsung Galaxy S9. Check out that beautiful epic sunset. The iPhone X has some nice sun flares going on. The Samsung Galaxy S9 doesn't. Now I'm going to do some nice sexy pans. Check it out. Wait a goddamn minute. That bell then should be straight. Samsung Galaxy S9 suffers rolling shadow. <laughs> I do like the front-facing camera of one of these phones more than the other. Really? Mm-hmm. Which one? I, I think your one, maybe. No, because, I think your one. Well, it's wider field of view, I think. Look at your face. It's a lot smaller. That's true. Yeah. But the picture quality seems to be a lot clearer on your one. Wasn't it? Yeah, oh, your one does grainy. look more grainy. What the quality over that's there. Hard. Whoa. It's interesting. There's a lot of action happening here. Now, no, nope, this Samsung Galaxy S9 has not improved the low light on the front-facing camera. <gasps> I remember the Samsung Galaxy S7, it had a wide-angle front-facing camera and it was ace. Oh, that was Yeah, good. that one was yeah, good. Was you see really the whole good. scene, you see yeah. what's going on. This one, you need to have really long arms. Mm. Okay, that's interesting. Which one is better? What I think, think the Samsung S9 is better in quality. My one just looks grainy. Yeah, but this is oh. grainy, but maybe the... No, the oh, X is definitely Oh my more god, the iPhone is a lot more grainy. more grainy. So the front facing camera is actually pretty good from the Samsung. That's Respect, really good. good job. Galaxy S9. What about you? Which phone do you guys prefer? Let us know in the comment section below. Ooh. It's getting actually kind of dark. See, I think the, the S9 is actually slightly better. The iPhone X is looking grainy. Well, it's not unusable, it's still usable. It's just cleaner on the S9. Yeah, so you look a lot more lit on the S9. Mm, yeah, it is actually brighter. It is actually brighter. Which camera will you choose? Ten or nine? Ten or nine? <laughs> added a tiny bit of light. Wow. All right, it's night time. Just doing S7 versus S9.
Now, I know we all just saw how good the video quality is on low light, but man, check out how bright this photo turned out in the same lighting conditions as the video. Samsung Galaxy S10, make the videos good like this, please. All right, the results are in. Woo! And I gotta say, the Samsung Galaxy S9's camera Yay! is actually pretty damn good. It's not just photos for videos, it actually does a really good job. I was recording some of these videos in complete pitch darkness yeah. and we actually saw some grains and all that stuff. Quality is better, better than iPhone X. Really good. Better than the <gasps> iPhone X, especially at low light. And I'm a low light kind of guy. If you get what I'm talking about, you want to get in the nightclubs, you want to get the filming. Shout out to HEVC encoding, which means all the videos being encoded, recorded right now is actually half the file size. No way. There is a couple of negatives though. 4K 60 frames a second only records for five minutes at a time. On the what? iPhone, on the iPhone, you can leave it running forever what? until it runs out of battery, all that stuff. However, on S9, for only five minutes at a time. Unfortunately, 4K 30 and Full HD 60 frames a second only records 10 minutes at a time too. You can get around this by using third-party apps like Filmic Pro and Open Camera. So it's not the end of the world, but still a bit disappointed there. Also, um, 60 frames a second doesn't do image stabilization. <gasps> So you're going to have like a little shaky, 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 shaky. Uh, the movie effect, the Hollywood effect. All you guys out there that's that talk true. about gimbals, get on my face. It's all about the Hollywood it shaky is. camera effect. It is. Ooh, it is. Arrow, uh... arrow. Do you know what I love is the picture clarity of the Samsung S9. The colours, I don't know what it is about them, but the colours look so vibrant. They just pop out of the screen compared to the iPhone X. Some, some minor, minor, no, that I'll, I'll get used to this, okay? On the S7, you had a home button. It was, it was a physical home button with a fingerprint reader. You double tap that, the camera launched. On the S9... What do you do now? You gotta tap the power button, which is on the side of the phone. I feel like launching the camera. Seriously, how'd you do it? You gotta go. There, there, you see? It works! Easy, easy! Samsung Galaxy, easy! It's not the S9, it's the S easy! It launched the camera, then he went to the home screen. It's confused. And that works. Easy. Samsung Galaxy Easy. Look at that. I'm, I'm mastering it. I'm master I really hate these buttons. They're so thin. This is not made for double tapping. My friends, this is not made for double tapping. This nice big chunky button. Why not make that double tap camera? Yeah, it's awful. It doesn't make sense. It's, it's really weird. It's really awkward. It's not natural. What I've done is I've remapped the big speed button to launch the camera instead. And that helps out a little bit. That's oh. I want to see what's going on in Bixby. I changed my mind. I want to take a selfie instead. Watching. Okay. But we can live with that because the camera quality is just that much better. All right, guys. You were watching this whole video made on the S9's yes. front-facing camera. The audio coming out of this is from the S9. This now, you know, this is hotel room lighting. So the lighting in this room dark. isn't that good. It's so dark. it's doing pretty good quality. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned yes. for the review video coming out. And our 2000 subscriber will be eligible or will win one of these bad boy phones that we'll be giving away. Asterix. This one's broken. It's probably going to be this one. <laughs> All right, stay tuned and let us know what you think as well and any thoughts or comments you guys have. And we will catch you for the next one when we're going to properly go into the S9's features. I cannot wait. You little shit. <laughs>